The respondent said the increase in the deportation of Nigerians from other nations is as a result of the fact that too many Nigerians are in a hurry to leave the shores of the country without records to processing the necessary traveling documents. Beyond what they are doing to us, I think the government will need to rise up and put those things that uh, our people are looking for out there, put them in place here, so that they also can be coming here. If our foreign policy is, uh, on migration is, is continuous, is our foreign policy on migration is uh, adjusted, is our foreign policy on migration is, uh, is built on, I, I can tell you that Niger this and the Nigerians in South Africa, Nigerians in India, Nigerians in Libya, Nigerians in Italy, Nigerians in America, Will be protected. The respondents who condemned the foreign policies of some countries towards Nigerians pointed out that Nigerians should not regard leaving their country as a better choice of high standard of living. Our young people should stop the idea of running out. You know, you are molested, you are attacked, you are brutalized, you are oppressed. As if, as if, as if you have no country of, of yours, you, f you are falling from the, from, from the sky. You can stay here, you can do something, and God will bless it. So you think that we, the youth, can just say we can stop on our own because we don't want to use violence. So I expect the state government and the federal government to do something about that. Recently, 23 Nigerians were deported from the United Kingdom while several other Nigerians are faced with xenophobic attack in South Africa. Aibo J. Ihoria reporting.